Um, we'll not have them for the morning night, but Absolutely. registration for Monday would be the ideal. Aye. So I made that yesterday. Can I get a number for Can I get a number? Squid or Okay. Can I phone you back in two seconds, mate? I'll make another phone call. Right, two seconds. Bye bye. My phone has been non-stop. Everybody's kind of hedging their bets, who they're going for. Do they want to leave a club? Do they not? The odd player would send a message. Then the agent start, and then you get the video clip sent to you. I get an email for a guy in Aberdeen that plays juniors that no amateurs on a Saturday, and he thinks that he could add to a front line. I read the first two lines. My name's Mark Kerr, Air United manager. Mickey, what do you mean? Scott Fustin. Fustin. Let's see what we need. I enjoy the transfer window because you're in charge of buying players. Um, Michael McArdle, an assistant manager here at Air United. The biggest risks um, in a transfer window, you just you just panic and, and jump in. Fans would be surprised at the depth of detail and they would be surprised as well at the amount of time that goes in. Because it's not just the January period, it's the two months before. I don't feel pressure to, to please them because I, I would you would end up just signing names. For me, I've not let that kind of influence me. I've always had my targets and, and I felt you've got to stay strong and, and what you go with. So anybody we sign, it'll be, I've been on the board um, down the stair. When you're signing players, you need to be aware of what your dressing room's kind of made of or what kind of characters are in it. Right, cheers, mate. Thank you. Bye, bye. Eight percent. Right. Just to get him off the board then. Aye. That one there then. Yeah. I think everybody at this level operates in the transfer market normally the same way. It seems to be the same players that bounce about. So we've we've went down a different route and tried to get into other markets, and and look at stuff that's a little bit different. It was just about the branding. Is it would that be a, a possibility, Leon, or not? I'm just pushing through the the registrations for that one. And then just wait on Celtic for that. My work was backing up the manager so he would get information on these players that are available, the match your profile, can you go and get more information? You're then using your network to find out about the character of players. And... So you sign for air until the end of the season on a loan from Ipswich? I'm hoping when I bring them to the start of 11 or coming on to games that the fans go, oh, this is a surprise, and, and they get that reaction. We've let a couple of boys go now, it's mutual consent kind of thing and, and there's no hard feelings. It's difficult when players leave the club um, during this period because you get people that have been in your environment potentially for a long time. There's been messy ones I've been involved in myself, I've seen other players been involved in and it can get quite, quite heated, but it's got to be done and it's not about who I'm upsetting, really. Mikey, all sorted there, eh? once you get there. Darn will look after you. Alright, and ask him all the time what you can do better, what, what you want to add. Aye. Okay, and I'll speak to Daz. Daz is my mate, so I'll speak to him regularly every couple of days just to see how you're going. But you keep in touch with us as well. Aye. Need to take your GPS with you Aye, so that right. I know your load's okay. So Aye. you're in charge of that now. Right. So you lose it, it's two grand. That's fine, I'll lose it then. <laughs> Good for the, the media to write about it and get a wee story for a couple of days and people get excited. It's not easy and boys don't pay a lot of money anymore. You can forget that players are, are young, they've got families, they're not as highly paid as everyone thinks that they are. I think now um, boys are on year-to-year -year contracts and there is a pressure um, to go and earn another contract. It, it does bring added kind of mental pressure to boys and I think fans maybe don't see that side of it now.